the angry African, I don't think anybody's going to contact us because we are going directly for the government. Yeah, yeah. We are going directly I mean, for... I was about to touch on that. <laughs> yeah, though. that I don't think... If, even now, we are trying to do a show on the 23rd December and still we've not had any sponsors yet because when they read the proposal that I wrote and they see where it's coming from and because the youth is angry and then they want to express themselves mm -hmm. so we want to create like a space where we come and jam and then for, uh, like air out our frustrations nobody wants to be part of it because i'm going to be on stage talking about all the um things that our government yeah. failed to do and so companies are scared to support things like this but the youth is struggling like people can't pay rent and things like and me i'll say this i've been saying this for years so 23 december sponsors or not we still can't stay can't talk on our mind but anyways uh, yeah so it's not always about the money it's about expressing yourself yeah. as an artist and when you express it to the extent that the people around you are also expressing the same thing everybody will connect to it everybody will connect and it will live forever because they won't stop stealing their money yeah. and you know we will not also be leading ourselves mm -hmm. but by all means we'll keep having president mm -hmm. and one day maybe to change but until then we'll talk so mm -hmm. it's not always about the money uh it's sometimes it's about the expression of yourself and the people around you it's necessary so i mean this this scenario of hitting a roadblock mm -hmm. and your search for let me say sponsorship yeah, and, uh, <laughs> yeah. what do you what do you make of the stance of these corporate bodies do you think look um, they need to defy whatever no, pressure hey, it is. No, they are making their money. You want <laughs> them to come and use you your proposal to support their business. <laughs> nah, they should do what... I understand that they don't mm -hmm. want to be part. There are partners I've been working with. You ask them, say, nah, I can't be part of this. You know, it's political. I'm scared. And nobody wants to be part of something that is going to voice out the youth's anger and frustration because the government in power is not doing well. Because... These governments, people to they are helping other restaurants and businesses thrive mm -hmm. because they've built restaurants, they've mm -hmm. built restaurants, they, have, they are doing private things mm -hmm. for themselves that people are actually managing, you know. Um, so those people cannot also come and say, Charlie, I want to come and do this because you can't bite the hand that feeds, that you. feeds you. So I have nothing to say to them. I understand, Charlie, we are cool, you know, I still with you you know we can still work on the next project which doesn't have to do with this but this has to be said because uh, it's in the air we can all see it 